Jag är så jävla tacksam att du är där du är och att du kommer vara hatad för all framtid. Ditt jävla CP. Du är ful, du är pinsam och helt jävla störd i huvudet. Jag kommer aldrig förlåta dig. Titt jävla äckel. We worked for a really long time. Uh, in Sweden you usually don't work for two and a half, three years on a short film. Uh, but it became such a huge process. A lot of people became involved and wanted to uh, have important opinions and affect the script. And you know, so it became a really long process. It wasn't hard to write the story, but the process around it was very difficult because I'm used to writing scripts in a certain way, uh, alone uh, and on my own terms. Um, and this was very different from that uh, because as soon as the funding came in, you know, a lot of people wanted to take part uh, in creating the story. So that was very difficult and, and I wasn't used to that. So uh, suddenly I was, I was writing on other people's terms, you know, so that, that was difficult. Uh, but creating the story wasn't difficult because the inspiration was already there and I knew what I wanted to. I was very, very aware of the people that I was casting in the film because in Sweden we have this will to believe that it's the immigrants that commit the crimes, especially the rapes. And if you look at the numbers, it's just not true. Uh, so I made a very, very conscious decision to not cast any immigrants in the film uh, because I didn't want to uh, in any way feed that prejudice that it's the immigrants that commit the rapes in Sweden.